Hello, welcome back to the next episode of the Tadu Gurry Giza. Video number two of the day, highly, highly requested. I recently did onion barges, not on video, and I absolutely nailed it. And of course, I posted it. Everyone's like, where's the video? Where's the video? I said, I didn't do one. So, yeah, look, there's a picture of them. What do you think of them, young geezers? Beautiful onion barges. So, I'm going to try and do it again. So, a couple of massive onions. All right, extra large. Or use three large or four medium. Up to you. Uh, Kashiri Muffy. Bit of chilli powder. Mixed powder. Sliced green chilies. Salt, sugar, pepper to taste. Ginger, garlic paste. Gram flour. Now, we must use gram flour. That is 200 gram of gram flour. And water. I haven't put a measurement on the water. You've got to do it by sight, okay? By feel, by eye. And get prepared to get down and dirty, geezers. Right. I want a shed load of oil. Onion barges. Onion geezers. Onions. Look at them. Oh my God, they're going to make me cry. Oh dear. Right. Right. The roots, okay? Easy way of chopping onions. Cut straight down the middle through the roots, okay? Put one side to the side. Keep the fat end. Chop the other end off. Peel. No, I'm going to have to chop that end off, and I. Ah, sorry. I'll go back to my way of doing it. I know Tom Carriage showed me an easy way the other day, but I have to do things my way. Right, I'm just going to take the skin off. I'm not going to bore you. Right, so I'm right-handed, so my left hand might be in the way, but tough. Right, so as thinly as you can, okay, so your roots are top and bottom, thin, okay, thin, all the way along. And because I've got large onions, if you haven't, then leave it as it is. Because I've got large onions, I'm just going to do one down the middle, like that. Right, get your mixing bowl. You need a mixing bowl, by the way. There you go, look. Perfect. There you go. Learn something new every day, don't you, geezers? Learning that I, amateur, keep chopping onion. Right, so that's one half done. We've got another three halves to do now because we've got two big onions. Okay, onions chopped. Gonna put them in my larger bowl. <coughs> All right. So now, all the ingredients, lob it all in, except for the water. We're not putting the water in just yet. Okay, chilies, powders, and cashew methy, salt, sugar, pepper. Ginger garlic paste. Whop it all in. Gram flour. 200 gram of gram flour. Okay, 200 gram. Right, mix it all up. Right, lovely job. Look at this. Oh, it's the best part, this is. Yeah, it's the best part, he says. Oh my God. Oh. Beautiful stuff. Right, right, it's all mixed in, so. <laughs> I've got 200 ml of water. I'm going to add half of it because we need it to bind, but we don't want it too wet. So, mix that in. Okay, that's pretty close actually. I'm just going to. I've used 100 ml, I've got 100 ml left, so I'm just going to use half of that. So that's 150 ml. Right, now we're going to make some balls. Okay, so just grab a handful. You want it about that size. <laughs> Not quite tennis ball size. So there's, there's juices. We need to squeeze the juices out. Okay, squeeze it out. And look at that, perfect. 
Okay, you're always going to have scraggly bits on the end. It's an onion bargy, you know what it's like. But yeah, that's a perfect onion bargy ball. Just like that. And now drop it in the oil. Right, oil. You need it deep enough to deep fry your balls. There, there's not a lot left in that tub. Might not be enough. No, I'm going to need some more. What is that? Got right, sunflower oil. Use sunflower oil or vegetable oil. So I'm going to put a bit more in there. A little bit more. And dispose of your oil in a sensible manner, please, geezers. Okay, if you know anybody that does tarmac, let them have it. Trust me, they will thank you for it. Right, now to heat up the oil. We want it between 170 and 180. When it's close, I'll show you how to test the, the heat. Right, just starting to get a few little bubbles now. So that to me now is getting close to 170, 180 where we need it. Best way of checking, drop a little piece of onion in and see how it reacts. Okay, we're getting bubbles off it, that's good. We want it to float, like that, right. That is on the maximum heat at the moment. Once I'm happy with the heat, I'm gonna turn the uh, flame down to about a six and a half, seven out of 10, like that, because I am happy with that. Right, um, that's it. Chop your balls in now, geezers. Let's get that little scraggler out. Right. Place them in, please, gentle. Right, you don't want it splashing all over you. This is hot. Okay, right, there we go. One. Two. Three. I've got six, so I'm going to do three at a time. Right, leave that for about three or four minutes now. Right, that's just over three minutes. So you saw me turn them, they've slightly caught, which is perfect. So I'm gonna give them another minute, minute and a half to do the top. I didn't quite put enough oil in to do the whole lot, but that's fine. Uh, make sure we keep them separated. They won't stick now, they're, they're hard look. Can't be hard balls. Shh. I've just made a minty yogurt sauce to have with them. Beautiful, won't be long now. Right, there you go. Onion barges. I can't say, I'm quite happy with that. Oh God, I love it when the plan comes together. Right, take that and drain. If you've got some kitchen roll, just leave them on some kitchen roll for a few minutes. Simple as. Oh God, they look brilliant. Oh, look at them. Oh, that'd be a good looking ball. And there we have it. I did a load of salad with it last time, but I ain't got any salad. So it's literally onion barges, yogurty mint sauce. So let's have a little gander. Right. There it is, look. Absolutely beautiful geezers. Oh, crispy. There you go. Smoking. Sorted. Mint sauce, get on my Facebook and you'll see how I do it. Or YouTube, because I've done a video of my mint sauce. Oh, so crispy. Oh, it's got three bits of chilli in it. Oh, oh it's going to be hot. Mmm. Oh, my God. Mmm. 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 Oh, I'm sorry, geezers, but that is better than you get anywhere. Oh. Oh, that is so good. 
I'll need some more of that. Oh my God. That is so good, people. Please, look, I'm an amateur. If I can do it, you can do it. Get on it. Mm. Mm. Oh. oh my God, that is so good. Mm. Oh, slap my legs and call me Nigella De Campo. Oh my God, that is absolutely delish. Right, I'm off. I've got another thing to do, get it. <laughs> mm. Right, follow me on YouTube, please subscribe. I'm on Facebook, I'm on Instagram. Come and join the party. I've got like 28,000 followers. Be another one. I'm off some NOS, Takukui Geezer. Out.